Chris Diego. I'm the managing director of Mountain View Grand, and behind me you will find our brand new Northern Power Wind Turbine, which we really enjoy. We're in northern New Hampshire, near the windiest place in, in the world, which is the top of Mount Washington. Mountain View Grand was established in 1865. It's the oldest grand hotel in the state of New Hampshire. And uh, it's here in Whitefield with really panoramic views of, of the White Mountains. And we have 145 guest rooms, uh, full service spa with a golf course. Mountain View Grand decided to put this wind turbine up because it was the right thing as far as environmental sustainability was concerned. Our situation in northern, in northern New Hampshire was somewhat unique. Uh, the only permit that we were required to get was from the planning board in Whitefield, which um, took about 10 minutes at a meeting. And um, we didn't, what normally people would do is uh, put up a met, uh, tower and study the wind. And we did not do that. And we are a bit unique because we were more interested in generating our own wind power. It's part of a much larger effort that we're making to do environmentally sustainable things at the, at the resort. Today's traveler is more environmentally conscious than they have in the past. And the, the wind turbine does help us convey um, all of our efforts because it's such a big thing and uh, it's, it's very dynamic and all of our guests come out and look at it and in the lobby we, we do have a display of, um, of the wind turbine, what's going on in real time. So people can come down and see how fast it's spinning and how much uh, energy it is produced and it's a very popular thing. On a corporate or group side of things, um, corporate businesses that, that come for meetings, that is, it is a very important aspect to many corporations. They want to come to resorts that uh, are environmentally conscious and are, are tempted to do the right things. And a lot of them um, have a checklist and you know, they, they want to know exactly what you're doing. And it's, that's important. So again, the wind turbine helped us convey that. It was a very simple installation procedure. It came like a Russian dolls in, in three pieces and uh, got installed. I think it took only a day and a half or two days to put up. There had to be a little bit of testing after that, but it was it was a pretty simple procedure. During our, our busy uh, vacation periods, we have a, a, ch a children's program that uh, has three sessions during the day, and they do a lot of different things, you know, activities, you know, fun things. But we also try to um, include um, educational activities where they'll go out and learn the different leaves of different trees, um, or learn some about nature around the area, or go down to the barn and understand the different animals. But one component is is the, is the winter. Um, so we're trying to convey, you know, the, the environmental sensitivity of the you know the property and the heritage of the property with the farm um, to our, to the children, so that they get a little bit more than just um, you know just a little bit more than fun. Plus, they always find it uh, interesting and fun to go back and quiz their parents because they know more about something than uh, their parents do. Like they know how to how the wind turbine operates and. Their father doesn't, so it's, it's kind of fun. It, it was very easy to work with everybody. Um, we were anxious to get, you know, to put up the, the wind turbine, and, uh, you know, once we understood it and signed a contract, it, 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 was, it was really quite simple. Um, out of all the construction and all the different things that we've done, it was probably one of the easiest things that we, we ever did. So, um, yeah, I, 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 for a, a school or a community that wants to put in a wind turbine, um, it's just trying to get people involved, get them to understand what it does, how it works, because there's some really great science involved.